Manny did not put together a great postseason resume with the things he said, the way he acted, the way he played. Does that impact the people that will pursue him and the money that he will get? I think it does. Some people disagree, but I think it does. I mean, common sense tells you that if I'm going to put $200 plus million plus into a player and, and maybe even $300 million into a player, I want to know that he's going to represent me and my franchise with the utmost class and the utmost respect and do things right on and off the field. I can't say that about Manny Machado. And this isn't, this isn't an opinion. This is just it's on, it's on paper. It's, it's on film. He is doing things on the field that are hurting his market because even if one team says, you know what, I don't want to deal with that, he's not good enough for me to deal with the stuff that comes with him, that, you know, by definition, that affects his market. And I still think somebody's going to pay him, but it may not be the team he wants to go to. It may not be the total dollars that he wants. And I think there's a lot of franchises out there that are looking for a – um, a face of the franchise, a, you know, a guy to, to be on the front cover of their, of their media guide, and I'm not sure if Manny's that guy. And I, I will tell you this, Mark, and I feel strongly about this. All right, so the Yankees signed Jacoby Ellsbury to a big contract. They had no idea his body would break down. He'd be unable to stay on the field. You know, caveat emptor. But if, in fact, anybody signs Manny Machado and he acts the exact same way he has acted, that he has opened the window for you to see, then that's too bad. You deserved it. I mean, it's all out there for anybody who wants to pay that money. He's shown you what he is. He did not put on an act as he was becoming a free agent. So there's nobody that has any kick coming if you give this guy $400 million and he acts the way he's acted. I, I agree, Michael. It's buyer beware. It's, you know, just like you said, I mean, there are certain contracts that are signed. I mean, you can say that about my contract. I mean, you know, when you sign the contract, you sign it because of the information that you knew, everything checked off. You checked every single box on the field, off the field, performance, you know, character, whatever it might be. Yep, yep, yep. This guy's worth a huge contract. There's a lot of boxes that are going to be unchecked with Manny Machado. That, that's a problem for me. If there's a guy who, who pre-free agency in the biggest spotlight in baseball, in the playoffs and World Series, is not hustling, he hits, in the World Series, Michael, he hits a ball off the wall and gets a single because he's, he's pimping the ball. Who does that? I, I mean, this is that's ridiculous. Okay, if it happens in May, okay, big deal. You know, you get a, you know, a slap on the wrist. Don't do that again. This is in the World Series. That kind of stuff can't happen. And you're right. It's buyer beware for anyone that signs Manny Machado.